Chef Pennington here. Today is the first of our five series where we're going to go through all five of the mother sauces. And today's hollandaise sauce, which is a really special emulsion sauce. That's the, the technique that we're going to be learning here that can be very complicated. And we're going to make it very easy today. Promise you guys. So we're going to start off with creating a double boiler. Really, we're just getting some water in a pot. One of the things you're going to make sure is that the water does not touch the bottom of the bowl. Otherwise, your egg yolks can start to burn, and that's not good eats. So we're going to get it to a boil there. We're going to start off with one tablespoon of water, and we're going to get some lemon in there. These are our classic ingredients besides the eggs and the butter that's going to be coming. We're also going to clarify some butter, which is really cool. If you guys like seafood and all that kind of stuff, often, who doesn't love some clarified butter there? pinch of salt here. We don't need too much salt. You can always do the TSA at the end, which is taste, season, and adjust. And also a little pinch of cayenne is very classic too. We're going to start off with two egg yolks. I say start off because you guys could choose to go with three if you like. But for this amount, two is perfect. It's going to make around a half a cup of sauce, a little bit more. So this is the part that's really important. We're going to pay attention to the color and also the thickness we're coming to 145 degrees. That's the safe zone for the egg yolks. And this is how you check back to a spoon. If it can swipe a line, you guys have emul you've, you've gotten it thick enough. It's not emulsification yet. That's where we need the butter. So here's how we clarify butter. Please use high quality butter. A lot of the cheap butter in the store is really a lot of water. And when you start doing this process, you'll notice where'd all my butter go? So high quality butter, we're going to melt it down. And what we're doing is we're separating the milk solids and the, the good fat in the butter. And you'll see that right there at the top, that it just naturally comes up. Now, one of the things that I've heard a lot of people think about clarifying butter is that it takes a long time and that you cook it and you cook it. It's completely opposite. Please think the other way. Get it done as quick as you can. We don't want those, the fat there to keep burning. It can become kind of sour and almost ammonia. It has a little flavor of ammonia. So just do it quick. That really works. Here's the emulsion. We've got our egg yolks there. They're still nice and warm. And we're going to start adding in our butter. And we're going to go slow. That's the key. If we add it too fast, these two fats will not come together and be one. It will become what's called broken. And that's not good eats. We certainly don't want that. So do take your time. Control the temperature below two. At this point, you want to definitely lower the water temperature. And you have hollandaise sauce. Very cool. So let's fix it, guys. This has happened to every cook that's ever made hollandaise sauce. It sits there, and boom. You know, you're cooking and your timing, and the kitchen gets a little off. It sets up, gets thick. Well, we're going to fix it, guys, which is really cool. Some people believe this isn't possible, but once you accomplish the emulsification, you're good. And this is how we're going to bring it back to life. Sour cream, guys. This is the secret ingredient. You could add this just to your regular hollandaise when it's perfect and you don't have to do this process. It just kind of smoothens everything out a little bit, rounds out the flavor. So one tablespoon of water, one tablespoon of sour cream. And you want to start off slow, get everything going. Once it starts coming together, you do want to you do want to whip it fast because there could be little pieces that get in there. So just take your time and no problem. Everything works out great. And you guys just fixed hollandaise sauce. Wonderful for eggs benedict. That's what I personally love it for. So this is the first of our five sauces that we're going to go over, guys. So do stay tuned. Go ahead and subscribe to our channel. Hit the like button if you enjoyed. There will be a link below. We'll have all the instructions and the ingredients and everything measured out for you on the website. And you guys take care.